Cramped is babysitting this morning. I cramped? Did you, you didn't lose count, did you? Yeah. Or, I or didn't a lose kid. count. I didn't lose count. One's I was going just out the door. Yes, I, think yeah, one I just watched her go out the away. door. I'm like, okay, what went out the door and he had a steering wheel? I'm like, okay. <laughs> oh I didn't, my I didn't gosh. plan that one, but hey, okay. Hey, yeah. You better check to see if your keys are in your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> right. I said, that reminded me of a car I had in college. There he is. Here comes oh my steering wheel. Oh, there you go, buddy. Okay. Oh, my God. All right. How cute. Yeah, go, yep. Okay. So He's got cute. a steering wheel. Uh, Random we... steering wheel. Okay. That's what happened. It's fine. Okay. Keep it. All right. Yes. Look at all my beautiful cherubs here. We're here at the Children's Museum of Cleveland. And this is really cool. This is kind of like the shadow room, right? Oh right? yeah, this is our playlist yeah, let's, exhibit. Let's we come over play here. with light and shadow in here mm -hmm. while also exploring different kinds of music. Yeah, and this is fun because you said every nook and cranny in the museum is an opportunity to learn. For Absolutely, right? learning in the most fun way possible. Like I mostly have to work when I'm here, but everybody else just gets to learn and play and have fun. Uh -huh. <laughs> And so everything just looks like playing and it just feels like fun to children, but they're actually really learning so much that's so vital to their early childhood development. That's cool. And this is kind of a fun place for the kids, right? Kind of, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you guys have done really good about being COVID-19 compliant. We see all the kids are wearing masks and Absolutely. the parents are wearing masks. But you've had to adjust the way you do things um, to make sure there's less people in the sessions. Yeah, absolutely. So we just want to make sure everything is as okay, safe as possible. Okay, let's all go this way. <laughs> for our guests and for our staff. So come on, everybody. Is important. Yeah, and so so that it knocks the numbers down. It knocks the numbers down tremendously, but that also allows the kids to really enjoy all of the uh, the things you have here as well. Correct? Oh yeah, absolutely. So lower crowds means lots more room to play. Kids who came here before the pandemic will notice it's pretty different. They've got lots more room to roam around. Lots of room to have fun, but still lots of space to make new friends and do everything that they love to do here. And the way you guys control that is uh, doing like time reservations. So parents need to factor that in when they're planning to come, correct? Yep, it's a little bit of a plan ahead situation. We are a pretty popular spot in the winter, so we do tend to sell out by the day of. But mm -hmm. if you think ahead a day or two, you should be good. And all the tickets can be bought online for a session, and we run two sessions each day. I see. Well, we have some budding Lady Gaga's and Justin Timberlake's <laughs> oh, up yeah. here, don't we? There's a lot of talent on the floor today, <laughs> Kenny. You're lucky that you're witnessing this. And weekends are really tricky, so parents, if they're thinking about weekends, definitely think ahead when they book. Yeah, weekends, it's always great to book ahead if you want to make sure you get your spot. Um, those do tend to sell out, especially in the wintertime when there's fewer options of places to go. But if you plan a little bit ahead, we're a great option for the wintertime, a great place to have fun indoors. In between the sessions, you guys clean and wipe the whole place down. So that's something that people probably don't realize, do they? Yeah, so that's a huge part of making sure it's a safe environment for families and our staff during the pandemic is making sure we're cleaning and sanitizing throughout the day. And the response to that has been really positive. I think families really appreciate that <laughs> extra step to keep them safe. Oh, we have some superstars here. Ironically, this reminds me of a meeting in the newsroom. Yeah, <laughs> just like it. Just it's like, like you never left. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, when we come back, lots to show you guys. We're here at the Children's Museum of Cleveland with some budding stars. <laughs> Two amazing. How oh, how sweet. Look at that. Guy. <laughs> nice. Oh, very nice. How sweet. <laughs>